to make a uh, quick centre finder for production work, first off, mark your 50mm square here accurately, then centre it. Just by marking a couple of lines across like that. Punch a hole in the centre. I use three quarter inch plywood because it's nice and strong. And then you put the screw in from this side, nice and straight. Put it right through. Take it back out again. And where your hole is here, drive the screw in there. So the point comes through just like that. The next thing we've got to do is put the borders in around here. The way I do it, get some glue, get some strips like this. Lay the first one out here, on the lines. We use a stapler, but you could use a screwdriver or whatever, no, screw, screw them in. Put the next one in. Making sure that we get it right on the lines. Followed by the next one. Oh, come on. This is just scrap plywood lying around. And the last one. Now we go over to the saw, trim these bits off here. Now the way it's used is you screw it to the bench so that it can't move. And this is where it gets its name from. We call them bonking boards. You put the bit of timber in clockwise like that, put it down onto the screw, bonk on the head, anti-clockwise and it comes off. The reason you've got to do it anti-clockwise is because the screw, there's a little bit of thread on the end of the screw and sometimes I can get jammed and it leaves a nice little centre hole like that ready to put straight into your, your spur drive and your tailstock centre. Thank you for watching.